Hi friends, it's Miss Karen again. So I thought we could play another number game this week since we did one last week and we're working on recognizing our numbers. Um, and then after this week, I won't do a number game again. I'll do something different, okay? But uh, um, since you guys know how to play the number game, um, I thought it'd be fine to do one today. So as you can see, I have my rainbow apples up on my board here. And let's go over the numbers together, okay? Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. So we have eight apples up there. And I have a little friend. His name's Herman the Worm. Say hi, Herman. Oh, and do you know what Herman loves? Oh my goodness, he loves apples so, so much. So the game we're gonna play is Herman is going to eat one of these apples, but on the other side where we can't see him and we won't know what number he's under and you guys have to guess. So it's learning our numbers by guessing where Herman is. Okay, I'm going to put, put my blind down, but don't go away because I'm still gonna be here. So don't close the video yet, but I have to down so that you don't know where Herman is going to eat. Let's see. Herman, which apple do you want to eat? Oh, that looks like a tasty, tasty apple, Herman. Okay. Oh, Herman chose which apple. So I'm going to lift this back over. See, I don't have Herman anymore. He chose an apple. I asked him which one and he told me which one. So you guys have to help me find him now, okay? So I know where he is, but you guys don't. So you have to guess. So everybody think, close your eyes and think of a number. Is it going to be one or is it going to be two, three, four, five, six, seven, or eight? So think of your number and then think of that number's color. So one is red, two is orange, three is yellow, four is green. Five is light blue, six is dark blue, seven is purple, and eight is pink. So think of your number and your color where you think Herman is. And we're gonna see if you're right. Okay, Herman, are you behind the red number one? Oh, he's not there, guys, okay. Herman, are you behind the orange number two? Herman, are you behind the yellow number three? He's not behind number three. Okay. Herman, are you behind the green four? Let's look. Oh, he's not there. What about light blue number five? Number six, the dark blue number six. Hmm. What about purple number seven? <gasps> He's behind purple number seven. Herman, was that good? If you picked purple number seven, then you win this round. He likes the purple apples, he told me. Oh, he told me he wants to eat another one. Which one, which one Herman? I have to put this down. He told me which one he wants to do now. He wants to try a different apple. Okay, Herman, you want to try this one? There you go. I'll put you on the back there. All right. Herman started munching on another apple. You guys have to help me guess. Guess. Help me, help me. Okay. This time let's go backwards because we went forwards. Now we'll go backwards. It's going to be super fun. Okay. Herman, are you behind pink number eight? Oh, he's not there. Maybe he stayed with seven purple. Do you think he stayed with seven purple or do you think he tried a different one? He tried a different one. Let's see if he picks the number you guys are thinking he's under. Dark blue number six. Oh, he's not there. Light blue number five. 
What about green number four? Okay. I feel like we're getting close. There's only three numbers left. Three, two, and one. Okay. Pick one. Where do you think he is? Do you think he's under number three? The yellow number three? Oh, man, he's not there. Let's see. No, orange number two. He's there. Did you pick orange number two? If you did, you won this round. So Herman's full now. He's not going to eat any more apples. So everybody say, bye, Herman. I'm going to just put him over here. He's going to he's gonna sit up here while he waits to eat the next apple. So my question for you is, if you could pick any apple to eat, which one would you pick? See, I, I think I would pick this pink one. Well, because I like pink but also because I've never had a pink apple before. That or a blue one. Have you ever had a pink apple before? Or a blue one? I don't think they make them like that. <laughs> but in real life, in real life, I'm a little bit allergic to apples, so I can't eat a lot and I have to have water. But if I could pick an apple to eat, I would pick a green one because they're sour and they taste really, really good with like caramel sauce or um, um, what am I trying to, or like with like a little bit of Nutella or peanut butter. If you're allowed to eat peanut butter, they taste good. Um, so yeah, if I had to pick an apple in real life, I would pick a green one. But if I had to pick one of these, maybe like blue or purple or pink or something, just because I've never had an apple like that before. So what's your favorite apple? And I'm going to ask you at school what your favorite apple is. So I want you to think about that because then you're going to have to tell me at school, okay? So um, I hope you guys are excited for next week. We're going to be learning all about apples, how apples grow. Um, and we're going to make a really fun apple art. We're also going to learn about the chicken this week. So I hope you guys are super excited for school. And I am super excited to see you. And... Um, Anyways, I hope you're having a lovely day. Bye, guys. Bye, 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 bye.